today, we've got what is possibly one of the most detailed Lego sets ever created. Stick around for the Home Depot. There's going to be uh, some surprise announcements during this video, so be sure to watch the whole thing. So over here on the left, we've got some exterior signage, stuff like that. Fencing, yep, 989 bucks. I'm assuming that's to do your whole entire yard. If you get with this one or this one, you're going to save almost a thousand bucks. <laughs> All right, we got Rocky Garden, the. Uh, fence in the grill there and uh, Zabadak Brad Nevin and me Brick Addict so got some uh, awesome signage stuff like that on the front enter exit unlike anything new ever done these have actual side entry doors like so so that is the entrance and of course tons of details snapper lawnmower some bricks there, blocks, masonry bricks, and everything has a brand on it. In that flower pot, you've got a Milwaukee wheelbarrow. Oh, what's going on over here? Daryl from Bevan Bricks and Dr. McBricker hanging out, watching the work being done. So we got a guy in a forklift who apparently just uh, dropped off a pallet of wood which this Home Depot employee is moving into the store. Little custom palette jack there, Home Depot colors. So, the outside contractor section, of course, alludes to the fact that maybe there's home services and rental inside. We'll leave this forklift driver uh, to drink his Sprite and finish his work. We're gonna go the contractor entrance. First thing we come to is the rental section. Rental section's got some books back behind the guy. And that is Tom. So Tom is our Home Depot rental professional. And looks like they've got a bit of cash. So got a pretty detailed sign as well. Lots of cabinets, stuff like that. And as we swing around here in a few minutes, you'll get a look at the uh, Pepsi machine and stuff from a different angle. So let's check out housekeeping and plumbing. You enter housekeeping and plumbing with a display of a hot water heater. And then of course, DeWalt. We got uh, actually the very first thing we built Couple months ago for this set was the uh, bathroom and kitchen displays. Those were built on a separate plate and we decided to stick them in here. So we took them off the plate and built it inside here. Of course, you've got all kinds of stickering right there. Housekeeping section has a little bit of everything. Everything has prices on it, as you can see there at the bottom. So Tide, Bounty, Clorox. Some all 
and uh, Clorox, stuff like that, and a pipe. So if you see a pipe, that means one thing, you must be getting close to the plumbing. That Pepsi machine, pretty cool. And now we'll move over and check out the plumbing. You've got quite a plethora of faucets right there and plumbing parts. You got chrome and looks like uh, plastic. Decent prices, eight some bucks and 21 bucks. Assuming maybe 21 bucks for the faucets. Right next to that is lumber, but let's take a peek up here first. Just adjacent to checkout lane number one, which is also the rental, you've got all snuggy and kind of a beat up DeWalt box. Um, lots of tools, a dolly, shovel, got a map of the place on the wall. Looks like maybe a thermostat control. Some more signs there, signage, decor, and you come to the lumber. Some of it is a little bit overpriced. And this customer here looks like she is getting a box of Clorox and a ceiling fan. The next department we come to in the Home Depot is appliances. And what you see here is actually what this whole entire set's scale was based off of. We had to make a decision on the size we were gonna do the washers, dryers, stoves, and stuff like that in, in order to decide the scale for this whole entire place. So that's a pretty good price on that fridge, $9.89. You got the uh, energy guide up there, Energy Star certified. Got a microwave sitting up there. We uh, we went pretty uh, heavy on the wall decor here. Some stoves over there. A couple of them look like they need wiped down. Microwaves, washer dryer combos there too. And uh, even on this side. Got some, uh, got a stove and a washer dryer combo with a microwave sitting on top. All right, this customer right here is getting, looks like a, a Dewalt drill, a five gallon jug of paint. Got lots of tools at Home Depot, of course. So got a couple table saws there. And uh, in fact, let's see. Uh, is that Aaron, I believe? Yes, Aaron. Aaron is our appliance manager, and she's showing off the appliances, or the, uh, the table saws, rather, to this very interested customer. And it looks like instead of getting a DeWalt product, he is actually getting a Milwaukee circular saw, a pack of light bulbs,